hi you guys so i finally got my contacts in it took me 20 minutes this time <sighs> look at my abs coming in we love her anyway i'm doing my makeup real quick but i just want to talk real quick serious is it that really serious is it ever that serious because it's not that serious but look at my eyes they're a little lighter i mean they're not like crazy but i tried the uh lighter ones in they're like a gray too light it looks so like fake um not that i don't already look fake but i mean if i'm saying it looks fake <laughs> bro question yourself i gotta be careful that these don't just pop out yeah the lighting's bad but you know what? i'm gonna fix that i'm not gonna be lazy youtuber today got a little ring light i do i do be prepared can't lose this charger this is a holy grail okay let's see no don't tell me this is broken oh wait this switch oh there <laughs> cute where should i put this now okay on me but not like on me let's put it right there and i put on my lotion oh it's gonna fall for sure let's play a game when will it fall anyway but no seriously why do makeup i have a serious conversation to have that needs to be had right and i'm probably gonna get so much hate for this so those are the conversations that are always fun when someone starts it off like that Okay, ready? So, hold on, let me get my shit in order first. And I can contour. Oh, I don't want you guys to see me contour. It's embarrassing. This eye is just... Because I accidentally had it open for so long and I blinked, so... <sighs> Whatever. I'll probably freak out and take these off sometime during the day. Okay. So what I was saying was... Oh, and by the way, you guys... I just want to tell you guys something real quick. <laughs> Let me tell you the key to your makeup not looking bad. Like, if you actually want to know what the key to good makeup is... And this is going to hurt some of y'all. This is going to hurt some of y'all for real. The key to good makeup... And, like, yes, lighting does have a lot to do with it, too. Like, you can, the lighting cannot be with you at the moment. But besides that, literally good products, okay? Literally good products will literally help you out. And I know they're expensive. Like, listen, I just bought this and this. Guess how much these two things were? $113. <laughs> like, literally but you know what i mean that's what literally if you want to know what makes the difference like how do i get a good makeup look the products babe trust me like i try to cheap on products this this brush is from the dollar store okay can't have both okay expensive brushes oh, brushes are like 50 bucks oh. but you know what you can finance your brushes on sephora 11 dollars a month or 11 dollars every two weeks you guys just do that that's what i'm gonna do with my foundation brush but i do have expensive brushes like i don't know i have expensive brushes from when my mom bought me them <laughs> but like the mixture i don't think i personally ever spend money on expensive brush except for one that oh except for this one or which one was it oh yeah i spent 30 dollars on this one brush i don't i don't know i was crazy this one 30 dollars on this one and it's like for um concealer but i used it for like contour but then i bought then i bought this one this one was supposed to be 20 but i got it on sale and this was just from shoppers and i think this work this works way better than this but this is obviously for concealer it does work good for like under the eyes this is nars i didn't even notice that oh and yeah i do have an anastasia like brush like this but i don't know where it is where is it whatever just believe me just believe me this is elf literally the same this is no different than the anastasia one hello you ready ready what time is it 12 30 okay so we're getting breakfast <coughs> it's 12 30 i'm almost ready for, actually 
I'm just contouring. Oh, these are the ones I'm wearing. I just gotta do my eyes, which I'm scared to do now. I don't want to get in anywhere close to my eye though now. <laughs> yeah, imagine I like, you know what, if I get makeup in my You're eye? Good now. Babe, I literally almost popped it out like just by opening my eye a lot. Like, I just had it like really open. Yeah, but you changed it like to a different color usually. Oh, yeah, no, I, I can do it now like really easily. Like, and once I do it, like once I know, now I'm not scared much. And just shove it in there. You guys should have seen. <laughs> Even he tried to put it in for me. But I got it. Okay. Now the eyeshadow look is like nice because my eyes are like kind of bluey. Like not blue, but they're lighter. So I can do it a darker eyeshadow look if I want to without it like darkening my whole everything but i think i might actually go for a lighter a lighter thing and i don't want to use any eyeshadow with sparkles right now because if a sparkle gets in my eye i will literally freak out oh my god i just fucked that up okay that's good you guys okay anyway back to the thing that is really important that i want to talk about really quick after it's been so long okay so let's talk about fetishes for a second because like there's a thing like you're not supposed to fetishize okay and if i'm wrong i'm wrong okay like i literally want to debate this like i just want to hear someone else's opinion like because i haven't heard this opinion before so I'm asking, okay, I'm not telling, I'm not saying I know all in this, like, I'm just saying this is my point. So feel free to say your points. Don't be arguing with me because I'm not saying that this is it. This is the answer. Okay. So you're not supposed to say, like, I, people get offended nowadays if you say, like, you fetishize, like, black guys or if you're, like, you're not allowed to fetish, fetishize race. God damn. Fetishize race okay but the thing is i don't get that because first of all why is that like bad like i don't understand why that's like that's kind of like a compliment like i don't know in a way to me i feel like that would be a compliment like someone fetishized light skins like yeah bitch. you know what i mean like when you want your race fetishized because it means like oh people like your features they're attracted to you like that's literally what fetishizing means right I don't know, maybe I'm wrong about that. Leave it in the comment. But yeah, so they like you. So yeah, A, I don't feel like that's an insult in any way. Like I don't I don't get it. I think that's like the opposite of racist because racist like a racist wouldn't wanna be with a black person or like a person of the different race. They wanna be with theirs. Like that's kinda right? That's kinda what racism is. You don't like the other race. But if you like them, like I don't know. Right? So, how is that racist? Like, maybe it's not racist. Maybe it's offensive some other way that I don't know. Explain, please. And also, B, the second thing is, how can you tell someone not to fetishize over something when you literally can't control a fetish? You literally can't control a fetish. Like, it's just what you like. You literally can't control what you like because a lot of people would probably change what they liked if they could. Like, I don't think everybody wants to be attracted to feet. Like, me, I don't see it. I don't know. But usually dudes, it's like dudes. Sometimes it's dudes. Because, like, I don't know girls that... I've not met one girl that's attracted to feet. But maybe there are. That's fine. I'm not fucking you. But the feet stuff, like, I don't know. It's interesting. It's not like I hate it. Like, it's not like I'm like... <laughs> like, it's just like, you like what you like. Don't do it around me. I don't know. Like, feet shit. Like, I would never. If a guy needed his feet, like, whatever, no. Yeah. 
anyway but that's that's fine that's what they like right i feel like some people that are attracted to feet probably if they could change that because you know it's not like it's it's a little like i don't know people that aren't attracted to feet you know are kind of like ew i hate feet like it's kind of gross right like lots of people think feet are gross feet are gross right but not everybody thinks that and I'm pretty sure not everybody is out there telling everybody they have a foot fetish, right? Why? Because they probably don't want to have it. Or whatever fetish. Like, so, you know what I mean? But the thing about a fetish is you can't control it. So, if you like a person, like, of color or, like, you like a Latina or you, like, it's, like, I don't know. I Maybe I don't know the definition of fetishizing that well. I can't even say the bitch. Like, I can't even say the word. So maybe that's where i'm misunderstanding is because i'm not like knowing the terminology but like i never claimed i'm a genius okay i just no one's telling me so i'm just assuming myself so is that like wrong to say like i just feel like i wouldn't care if someone fed like it's nothing that i think i need to jump into and say hey that's wrong like someone's being racist to someone saying oh i think all these type of people should like die hitler right then i'm gonna step in and be like that's not okay but like if someone's fetishizing someone i'm not gonna step in and be like that's not okay right i don't know that that's just me um because i'm pretty sure hitler wasn't fetishizing no jews like i think he just wanted them to die right that's what i feel like um like, that's what I feel like is not okay. But I don't know. Like, maybe it is offensive. Like, I don't know. How is it offensive, though? That's the thing. Like, I want someone to sit down and tell me how it offends them. Like, how are you getting offended? How are you getting offended? That somebody wants to fuck you? Like, how are you offended by that? You know what I mean? I don't know. Like, am I crazy? Am I going to get canceled now? I just don't understand. I don't understand. And honestly, like, it's just a preference. Like, I know people are saying, oh, it sounds like just a preference ass bitch. Like, you know, like, people don't like it when you say that. But it is. Uh, like, what? Like, it's not like a person saying, oh, I wouldn't absolutely not sleep with this person because I don't like that race at all. Period. Point blank. Like, there's attractive people in, like, every race. And then there's ugly people in every race. That's that's how it is like or sorry i should word that differently there's people that other people no there's no other way to word that <laughs> i was gonna try but i really just don't have the time bitch i just be saying what i want to say like i know people are like you shouldn't be saying people are ugly okay listen i know the eyes in the beholder blah 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 but like come on there's some people that most people will find more attractive like the majority of people like you know what I mean? Like, the ma majority of people are going to find, like, freaking, like, people who maybe, like, Megan Fox attractive. Like, shit like that, right? You know what I mean? If someone's like, Megan Fox is ugly, I'm going to be, like, kind of look at them like, okay, like, can you fucking see? I I'm not going to argue with them about it, whatever. They don't think they're attractive. But then there's significantly, like, I'm sorry to say it. Like, are we just going to pretend like there's no, like, there's people that don't try. Like, I'm not going to stay on and say what, I'm, what you know I'm going to say. But there's people that don't be given no fucks. There is. There just is. So, if you don't try, I mean, how are you going to, like, yeah, like, you're not going to probably be the best of that you can be, like, looking-wise. If you don't take care of hygiene, you don't do the most, like, it's all about trying. Like, that's literally what being attractive is, is get trying. <laughs> Bitch, Megan Fox gets up every day and fucking tries. If you are attractive, you fucking try. Like, you're doing the most. You know, you're moisturizing. This, that, whatever. Every attractive person. If you don't think so, I hate to break it to you. I hate to break it to you, babe. But I'm not going to say it, but just know. I just, I can't even argue with those people. I can't anyway so yeah is this fetish thing like am i am i being canceled now or what 
because I really wanted to say that. I don't care. Because I don't get it. Like, I just want someone to explain. Oh my god, I'm, you guys are watching me contour my nose, being a fake bitch. Yeah, watch this transformation, bitch. Let me show you. Let me show you. <laughs> watch this look like shit now that I talked all this shit. No, God, please don't do that shit to me, please. Because I gotta get it right today. I got to get it right. And sometimes, yeah, you know what I mean? Okay, let me tell you something again with the makeup thing. Like, you know how I said you need expensive makeup? Okay, you don't need expensive makeup. Like, you can make non-expensive makeup look good. Like, trust me, I've been doing it for years. <laughs> Bitch, like, I'll sh <coughs> This eyeliner is from the dollar store. Okay, this brush... Hold on. This brush, the dollar store, okay? Like, I do have, like, some things from the dollar store, but... I, I don't get, like, products, except this eyeliner is the exception. I don't know why I made it. Because it literally works the same, but I'm sure it's with the worst chemicals ever. Probably, like, wrecking my eyes. Like, I don't know. But I do have a different eyeliner, too. That's, like, I got it as a gift. But the next eyeliner I'm going to get it is going to be expensive, I think. From Sephora. Like, liquid eyeliner. I don't know. I just started recently using liquid eyeliner again for, like, the op top. I don't know why I wasn't always doing that. Because that's it's going to make it look chalky if you just use, like, a pencil on the top. Don't use it on the top unless you're connecting in there. But that'll be another thing. I should really show you guys. Guys, I'm going to be nicer and, like, actually teach you shit. Like, I should actually be. Because I'm actually not fucking stupid when it comes to this shit. You ask me anything about math or, like, you know, I'm not the smartest. But, like, I can add up the money I need to get that makeup product, if you know what I'm saying. Okay? Priority okay and this is this is always how it ends up going but i will fix it because this is getting better so yeah what i was saying oh yeah you need expensive or sorry um yeah getting expensive makeup products is gonna make it easier to get it right every time like if you're wondering fuck why is it not turning out good like why is it so hard to turn out good like it should be so easy it's the products babe like you know what I mean? Like, yeah, you might get it right one or two times with the shitty products, but make it with the easy products, like, you just know it's gonna look good, like, you know, but it is, like, 70 bucks for, or 120 bucks for two things, but, like, 60 bucks, almost 70 bucks for a one foundation, I get it, like, that is ridiculous when you could literally get $12, but if it's not turning out good some days, like, you know why. Like, you can't be surprised. And I was literally surprised, like, why wasn't it working out? Like, bitch, I don't know. I just didn't put the logic together. I was like, it should just look just the same. Like, obviously, there's a reason why the products are more expensive, you guys. Like, if it was really the same, you think it, they could just do that? No, everyone would just get the cheap shit. Like, why, right? Like, some things I do understand. Like, those face rollers, they'd be charging $20 in Sephora. Bitch, I got mine from freaking the dollar store. But it's probably made out of something different. But who cares? It's gonna be the same shit. You know what I mean? It really is going to. Let's see this color. Should I use this color? But I want my lips kind of like a pink. Oh, this is nice. Oh, I really like that. Mm -hmm. Okay, this is the color Eden. Eden. Beige Eden 180 Glow Paradise L'Oreal. Okay, shoppers. So good. Learned it from TikTok. And I should really tell you. I'll, you know what? I will tell you guys more information. Because I don't be like, I don't know. I just don't think about it. But I should do my makeup more. And then I'll think about it because usually when I'm talking with you guys, I'm out. I'm not going to be talking about my makeup. Like what? But now that we're doing it on the same subject. But yeah, this video is already too long. So um, you'll just see in the next vlog how good my makeup looks after the fact. Okay? All right. Have a good one.